Ah, shadow of judgment. Hello, we got air and water left, y'all. That's neither, but okay. Um, I'm not sure what the fuck that is. <laughs> so let's see. Who shall we have? Secrets. It's going to be water signs. Pisces, Cancer, I guess this is going to affect you the most. This is this, since this is your card, right? But you're definitely dealing with some secrets or something hidden from the light, right? For anybody who's new, Shadow Judgment Story, look for the weakness, right? We try to look at the nooks, the crannies, secrets, subconscious, shadow sides of you or yourself. For the week, this week, the, what is it? July 26th to August 2nd is the week we're going into, right? Right. Now, water signs. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and Jupiter. Because I almost forgot Jupiter. So check your charts and see what's in it. If it resonates with you, good deal. If not, do not worry about it. It's a card game. It doesn't work if you don't believe in it, right? Cancer, you're up first. And there you are, being as chipper and happy as ever. Offering your cup up without issue but something isn't beginning here for you and i don't know what it is yet because i've only laid down two cards like you're trying to start something from back in the day because something isn't starting in the future or something isn't coming up in the future uh you might be looking at it a little bit like you don't like it is that what yeah that's the direction the emperor is looking at he's looking at it's like i'm not starting anything yeah you know, which I love it back in the day when you were young and wearing blue and I think a tunic or a kilt. Yeah, that's a kilt. No, that's a tunic. That's a tunic. Now, you might not be waiting for something you feel like something isn't coming in and this was supposed to begin a new cycle. There isn't a start to this cycle that you want to begin or you've decided against it. One of the two. Um, you might have been, okay, either you or the person you're dealing with has been so arrogant that they kind of fucked themselves over, you know, self-betrayal almost, or they're victimizing themselves to a point where it's hindering them now. Uh, feeling like there's no reason to really fight for anything, but in this new cycle, it's like being totally stressed out, like caution, um, keeping themselves up at night, dread, guilt, sorrow. A lot of mental anguish. Oh, there are them secrets again. You're not even expressing it, Cancer. Or the person you're dealing with is not. Whoever this Emperor is, he's kind of like... A jerk, I'll say. Hmm. Weird. Like, two separate twos came out. These two came out because they were up. Face up, I mean, you know. Like, I could actually see it. But then these two came out. It was just like the person who is, um, alone, financially savvy or whatever. It's like they won the battle, but they lost the war. Whoever they caused to walk away stayed walked away. They didn't come back to get the swords and play the game some more. They're just, uh-uh. You can do that, right? All right, Cancer. Let's see. Like, back in the day, you guys offered your cup up. But now it's like, that's over and done with. You've kind of given up on it to work on some other shit, right? However, this emperor right here, he's a dick. He's a troll freak. He is not trying to be fair. In fact, looking over all this with a lot of, like, uh, irritation, I feel like. But... It's because it's like he's more irritated at his own actions. Or he recognizes that his actions are not helping the situation, but he's not saying anything about it with the moon. Keeping that under wraps, not letting anything be known, right? And what he's staring at with a lot of, like, agitation and stuff is the fact that something didn't start a new cycle. And they might be, this person might be just stuck in their head about that shit because they were looking for their happiness. And they're still trying to work on their happiness right? I don't know which one to pick out. Well, no, I'll pick out the secret. What's the secret? Because I like secrets. Like, I think the best 
quote I've ever heard about secrets is a secret can be kept between three people if two of them are dead. Which is true. Um, slow moving offer, probably from the earth sign, but someone is offering bullshit to the earth sign? Or they're doing it to themselves? Hmm. It's like he's coming in slowly, but when he comes in slowly, this Page of Pentacle, who, you know, when it's Page of Pentacle, I always like to say, the Page is an idiot. He just, like, strings up and be like, here, pie to the face, boom. And then, like, everyone at work is just kind of, like, staring at each other. Like, is this, was this part of the plan or something? And then the Tower Amendment strikes down, which is like, what the hell does that mean? It's like when this... Oh, I guess because that's karma. What? It's like what, it's like whoever this is who was supposed to be writing in, as soon as they wrote in, someone just gave them some, nothing but disappointment. Could have been in a work environment or a work relationship or co-workers were having an affair with each other. All things are possible with the Lord, right? But um, it's like when it came to the cooperation between these two right here, It was like, that's when the tower hit and like justice came down. What's this tower? Because I'm confused. Um, someone might be trying to come out of the interest, someone would be coming out of like introspection and seeing things, recognizing reality, I feel like. They had spent a great deal like looking for information or being keen on spying and shit. Um, restricting themselves because they were heartbroken. And wanted to move on the calmer water. So I don't know what this is, Cancer. I'm not entirely sure. I'm kind of confused. It's always with you and the air signs I get confused with. Because it's just like, hmm. Well, okay. Um, but it does feel like that whoever it is that um, you are dealing with, either it's you or that person who's slowly coming up with the offer... The other person's going to come out way more immature and offer bullshit, essentially. And then, like, I don't know. It's something to do with, like, cooperation between a bunch of people. Um, philosophy, architecture, banker, you know, all those are really important with each, with each other. And it's like, I don't know. It's like, okay, it's like... The knight knows exactly what to do, but this page has a different idea of what everyone's job's supposed to be, and they keep offering up to this dude, right? And then that's why the tower comes in, it's just kind of like, you know, the knight's like, well, I wrote in with this, and he's like, well, I got a cherry pie, it'll go right in the walls or whatnot. That cherry pie is not good for mortar in brick walls. But it's got Crisco, you know? It's like this person does not, it's like they're not mature enough to understand how things are actually supposed to work. They probably are one of those people who, like, because they don't, because the Page of Pentacles also is somebody who doesn't want to learn. They're supposed to be a student, but they're refusing to figure things out or understand the lesson. And it could be like this person is just way too hard-headed to understand how everyone's supposed to cooperate with each other. So, be very careful with that cancer. Alright. Scorpio, you're next. Let's see what your shadow is, right? Right. What's going on for you this week? Oh, you get the hanged man. You're hanging around. Yeah, like you're surrendering something so the tower hits. Okay, well, as long as you know what you're doing, which you usually do. You're at a crossroads with it, too. Uh, you're looking at that cup like you're Glenn Close and Fatal Attraction, but you have not boiled the bunny yet, so you're not that crazy. But you are holding a grudge. You are holding a grudge. You have your back turned to this tower like, you know what, I'm just going to make this happen. And then I'm going to sit here and wait until they come to me, and then I'm going to throw shit in their face because I can. Right? There's a slow moving off over here. Could be with a earth sign. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, right? 
And this tower mode is going to leave some people feeling like their cups got knocked over and they're going to have to find a way of getting over it with the bridge. Take their cups over, buy themselves some shoes to make them feel better. Um, I feel like you just don't want to offer... Hmm. Now what is this? Like, you're staring at your cup, but you're definitely not offering your cup. I don't think it's towards the Knight of Pentacles, but I feel like it's more about this tower. It's like you're trying to get away from it. Like, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. nope. Not even. Um, this over here speaks of cooperation, though. So this is like, this entire row is like separate from this. I'll just say that right now. Yeah, shit options. Shitty options. Some righteous justice, possibly Libra. Um, someone is coming out from the cold here. You probably got your guard up, but there's a happy ending for you, so that's a good deal. All right, Scorpio, your shadow. Might be at a crossroads right here, willing to offer something in order to come together with somebody, because, yeah, you or them might be feeling left out in the cold, and they want that shit to be over. However, Scorpio, you're staring at your cup being like, I still have all these hurt feelings. Knight of Cups says, fuck you, I'm taking my cup somewhere else. Might be offering it to the Earth sign or something like that, I'm not sure. But both of them are very slow, taking their time. Feeling like it's the right thing to do because you are keeping your guard up in order to get your happiness out of the way. However, there's this tower over here where someone's really mauling over the things that got knocked over. Oh, excuse me. Uh, they still got two cups, though, so they can walk away. Go to the mall. Get, all, get on the bridge to get over all that shit, right? It just feels like there's a lot of options that aren't left for this person, right? It's like, all these cups got knocked over. I almost had my ten, but now it's like, nothing looks good with the rest of these. So it's like, I'm just going to take these other two cups and find somewhere else to go. Might be third party, might not be, but there is that involvement right there. Let's see. What is it about these options? Giving them up. Just turning your back to them. Possibly dealing with a fire sign, Leo Sag Aries, but you might just be like done. You might have lost your patience for this shit. Like, nope. Doesn't make me happy, so I'm getting out of this as quickly as possible. Also, Leo, most likely with that with the sun card. Okay. Okay. So that is your shadow, Scorpio. Be very careful. You know? Pisces, you're next. Let's see what's going on with you, Pisces. Oh, yes, Miss Howard. I want to try to get yours done today. I've just had other people I had to get a hold of, too, but I will get yours to you at least by tonight. Promise. Okay. Empress Reverse. Someone's a bitter mom. <laughs> Someone is a Karen. She wants to speak to someone's manager. <laughs> Wheel of Fortune. Okay, someone might be a little bit angry, but they're trying to move forward with the Wheel of Fortune, right? Trying to keep their securities to them. Might be one to fight somebody, possibly air sign. Could definitely be Libra. Also Taurus and Aries in this as well so far. Um, Wheel of Fortune spinning on this lack of fairness. Someone's got to cling close because they got options, right? Someone's got the truth. Ooh. Maybe that's why someone's went in the fight. Someone's got some shit to say. Follow your intuition because things are not working out the way you thought that they would. Or the way they were supposed to. And someone might be trying to judge accordingly with that. Okay. Pisces, let's look at yours. Mm. Yeah, so it could be you that's not all, but it could be anybody else as well. Possibly Air, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, also Taurus, and Aries, female type. 
particularly. <clears throat> and of course, here's a male version if we need one for the fire signs, but that's okay. It's like Leo down at the bottom. But yeah, you could be dealing with an air sign for sure who's just like... Or you could be trying to fight an air sign because like, you know, you're going in wielding your sword, trying to come back with the truth, knowing that things won't work out properly, right? You might be trying to hold on to what makes you secure and you're looking at your options on how to deal with the situation in particular. Using your intuition and keeping all the things that you know hidden. Like, if there's a weakness that someone's looking for in you, you're making sure to hide it so they can't pick it out through all of these cups, right? And you're trying to judge accordingly on what you should do next before you take any more steps. Because um, you know if you do move forward in whatever the situation is that's left you like a bitter empress, um... It'll leave you feeling like you've been placed in an unfair position again, and you really want to make sure that you make the right choice before ruling on what should happen. Let's see. I don't know what to ask about, so I'll just lay out some. Okay, so there definitely is wish fulfillment here, right? Like, someone made a wish, it came true. Um, and it has something to do with the Page of Wands, Stinky Feats. Mm. Oh my, okay, so like, there was, a, I feel like someone came back around that you wanted, and they just showed their ass to you with the page of wands right here. Um, tried to come back to you with some sort of apology or some words to try to express how they like screwed things up. And all it did was just piss you off all over again. It's just like, God damn it, I just got you out of my head. And now I'm going to be sitting here thinking about all that rude stuff you did before. Now it's like Glenn Close, um, Fatal Attraction, I boiled the bunny because you didn't want me kind of thing. You know, that's why the Empress is reversed. It's like this person came around to try to, like, I think, fix things. And it was almost like they just made it worse. Or they made it to where, like, you, you, you learned to be careful what you wished for. Because this person really put a number on you. <clears throat> what is it this person did? The Seven of Swords. Or no, the Page of Wands. What's up with them? They want to walk through the fucking door. They want an open door with you. They want an open door. Because they've been left out in the cold. Following you around like a puppy. But they are very, very... They won't, I feel like they won't take no for an answer. And that's too bad, as far as I can see. Like, they, won't, they, don't want to, they, they don't want to accept that, like, this is over, I feel like. Like, dude's just grabbing her cup, and she's just like, go ahead and take it. It's not arsenic in it, I promise. You know, like... <laughs> like, ugh. Yeah, I don't like this person. Be very careful, Eric. Uh, Pisces, not Aries. Well, Aries is there, but still. It's, it's, it's just like, you know, be careful, because I feel like this person will, might just do or say anything to get back in your good graces. But that's the end of your reading, Water Signs. Thanks for watching this far. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. It's up to you, really. No pressure. Um, if you want a personal reading, my email and information is down below. I usually do the first readings for free, and I take dips and dips, tips and donations if that's what you want to do. No biggie. Um, I will see you guys later, and you take it easy. Bye-bye.